Welcome to HTML Tutorials. This is lesson number 29. And in this lesson, we're going to talk about what a character set is. So let's go ahead and get started. The first thing that you want to do is make sure that you have the previous document open from the previous tutorial. And once you have that open, let's go ahead and get started. Before we actually do anything in our HTML document, I'm first going to explain what a character set is. A character set is basically a set of alphanumeric information for helping your web page to display correctly. In other words, we could have the letters A through Z, and any of those letters could be used on our website. We could have the numbers 0 through 9, and any of those numbers can be used on our website. So basically anything that falls within that character set is allowed to be used on the website. So for example, if you only had the letters B through Z, then you would never be able to use the letter A on your website. If we only had the numbers uh, 1 through 9, you would never be able to use the number zero so that's the importance of a character set it basically has a set of information in terms of alphanumeric information that you'll be able to use within your website and the web browser is going to use that character set to determine what type of information you can display in terms of text on your website so now that you kinda of understand what a character set is we're gonna go ahead and write the meta tag for uh, a character set so to do that we want to click after one of our meta tags within our HTML document so look for the last meta tag that we wrote and we're going to click right after that so that we keep everything in the proper section in this case you're going to write your meta tag in the head section so I'm going to click right after the last meta tag and then I'm going to write angle bracket then the word meta and then we're going to write a HTML attribute in this case we're going to write char set and that stands for character set and then we're going to write equals and then in quotes in capital letters UTF hyphen 8 and that's one of the names for a character set in this case we're using UTF hyphen 8 because it usually includes most of the uh, characters and symbols in the world and you're going to get most of your value out of using the UTF hyphen 8 so char set stands for character set equals UTF-8 and that's just the name of the character set that we're using and this is a HTML attribute in this case the name is char set and the value is UTF-8 now there are many other uh, character sets that you could use but I recommend you use UTF-8 if you're dealing with HTML5 but if for some reason that is different at the time of recording this video maybe things change in the web design sector then you want to research and find out what character set you should be using for the particular time period. So once you have that in quotes, we're going to go ahead and write our ending angle bracket, hit control S, and we're going to save that. Now for the character set, you're not going to see anything on the front end of the website. When someone views your site, they're not going to know that you're using a character set for UTF-8. This is something that shows up on the back end. So I'm not going to actually go to the web browser and preview this. So I hope this video was helpful in helping you understand what a character set is. And don't forget to embed, comment, share, and subscribe. And stay tuned for future videos on HTML. Have a great day.